and welcome today. During this short video, we'll take a look at the CCH Pro System FX Scan application to get an overview of the complete scanning workflow. This big picture view should help you step through the process. We'll start by reviewing our document preparation steps. We'll then take a look at some general scanner settings that will apply to any type of scanner your firm may be using. However, if you're using a Fujitsu scanner, the workflow will be slightly different and you may want to view our other video on this topic. Finally, we'll review the quality control steps and how to use the Import Assistant so files can be picked up by the CCH Pro System FX Scan Administrator. As we take a look at this workflow diagram, I want you to note this basic workflow will be applicable to both your 1040 and 1041 work paper files. We'll break the workflow down, starting with the document preparation. At the very top of the file, we want to use a cover page. Your cover page will designate the client and will be printed from your CCH Pro System FX Scan workstation. Alternatively, if your firm's using one of our document management applications, you'll need to substitute this with a document routing slip printed from Document Central. Our document and scan applications can be integrated to auto route files once scanned, so it's important you use the document routing slip instead. With the cover page created, next take the source documents received from your client and begin to sort it. Sort it between documents you want to scan from the documents you don't need to scan to avoid scanning frivolous pages. Next, sort out the single page documents from the multi page documents and begin to insert your target sheets. Add one single page target sheet on top of all of the single page documents and one multi page target sheet on top of each multi page document. Target sheets provide instructions as a scan application so it knows how to group pages together within the final digital file. If you decide to use color paper for target sheets, the colors we found to work best is a pastel yellow for a single page and a pastel green for a multi-page target sheet. After we perform our document preparation, we will scan and review our documents during a quality control step. When we talk about scanning, you'll find some general settings listed here. However, if you need any additional information, please visit our support website and view the document scanner tips to improve image quality. In most cases, after you scan your work papers, they will be available on screen to perform a quality control check. Most of our successful firms perform a QC on each and every file since catching a mistake at this point is much quicker and efficient to correct. Quality control may include counting pages, verifying completeness, and the contrast of images. Once the QC steps are complete and you're happy with the results, you'll need to move the file into the scan administrator for processing. To do this, we'll use the Import Assistant. First, locate the files that you just scanned. It may be in a Scan QC folder on the desktop of the scanning computer. Next, open the Scan Workstation module and simply drag and drop the files that were scanned into the main window. This will automatically open the Import Assistant. From the top of the window, you may have some different options for processing 1040s or 1041s, so select the appropriate option and press the Import and Close button at the bottom. Files will be sent to the Scan Administrator module immediately for processing. When it reaches the scan application, the server will perform a series of processing steps, including image enhancements, recognition, and data extraction. When the CCH Pro System FX Scan Administrator completes the processing steps, the file is marked ready for autoflow, and a preparer can start the return and perform the autoflow steps when applicable. Once autoflow is complete, they will obtain a draft of the return as well as the organized bookmarked digital file. As we wrap up, I want to thank you for joining me today, and I hope this short video helped you put the pieces of the workflow together. For additional training and resources, please click on the link below to visit our training and consulting webpage.